welcome back and I know you're probably tired of me doing it. It's like I'm flapping. I'm flapping. I'm flying away. <laughs> Anyways, um, since I already have everything set up, I figured I'd go ahead and do another little video for tonight. Um, and I have an unboxing. Now, I was kind of disappointed when I got this in the mail, but and I haven't I haven't actually delved into it. I did order this probably a, almost a month ago, I want to say. I know it's been a while. It, it's at least been like two to three weeks. And I know whenever I ordered this stuff, they told me it was probably going to be a while. But um, here's our little box. Now, I thought, I thought with the stuff that I ordered, it was going to come in a little bit bigger box. Not... Not something this small, so I was a little disappointed when I got the box. So hopefully the contents in the box are going to be a lot better than, than the size. So I'm going to try not to judge it by its size. But all the stuff that I'm fixing to show you, it came from, what is it, a Coca? It's either Coca Pink or Kuka Pink. I'm not entirely sure how you're supposed to say that. I'll put the I'll put the name over in here for you somewhere so you can check that out. But um, oh here it is. So do do cover up everything. So there is the name of the store. Oh, and they put me a little thank you on it. So that's very nice. I'm gonna name everything. Want you to enjoy everything that I got. Now this is a company. I want to say it's based out of Georgia, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a. Uh, Based out of Georgia and everything is supposed to be like all natural, vegan friendly and stuff like that. So here is all of the contents in the box. So let's see everything. Now I did order everything so I did pay for all this by myself. This is not sponsored anything so not an ad. I did pay for this because I saw it. I saw somebody else get these and I really wanted to try them. So I figured while I'm trying them I can do a video on it. Maybe somebody else might enjoy these as well. Now they did all they sent me a little um they sent me a little little tester or a little little sample here. And this is for their caramel popcorn balls. Oh, I was looking at getting this in, so I'm glad they sent this. But um, the stuff that I mainly got was their body butter. And I wanted to try, I got their sample pack for their perfume. Because I want to get the bigger ones, but I wanted to try out and see which one I like first. I think I ended up spending, I know it was fairly expensive. I'll give, I, I want to say it was fairly expensive for both of this. It was either... 30 or $40. I'm not entirely sure, but whenever I know the price, I'll, I'll stick it up here somewhere because I have to go back and look on my actual receipt where I bought everything. But I want to say it was around 30 or $40. So it was fairly expensive, but depending on the, like how everything is, I'm probably going to enjoy it. So let's just test out. This is their body butter. This is one of their body butters. This is the little test sample they sent me. And on the back, it says caramel popcorn balls. Now this is one of the body butters I was thinking about getting and I changed my mind in favor of something else. So I'm kind of glad I got a little sample of it. Let's see how this smells. Oh look how creamy that is. I know body butter is not really supposed to be creamy but that's actually really creamy. It says it's body butter so. Oh my lord. Oh that smells. Oh my god that smells so good. I, w I wish we had smell vision It smells like caramel popcorn. And I should know because last time me and Eddie went to the mountains, they had there's this popcorn place. It's a really cool place. If you ever go to Chimney Rock, North Carolina, I'll, I'll have to put I'll have to put some of the information down below. The place is really cool. But um, yeah, they do like a lot of specialty popcorn and they make it in house. And this is, oh my god, this reminds me of that. This smells so good. Oh, and it goes in really good, too. Ooh. Ooh, I might be ordering a big one of these. Because I think the big ones are only $8. So they're fairly, they're fairly decent priced. Oh. Okay, that, that got even... Okay, so in here, it smells really, really sweet. So this does smell really sweet in there. And then I put it on, and you can really, really smell it, too. Like, as you blend it in more of the popcorn and the caramel comes through but mainly you get like a good mix of that caramel popcorn scent oh that smells so good oh this is gonna be fun okay so first one's already done so let's see what else i have in here um let's see here. okay so now here is 
I want to say this is all of my little perfumes that I will be trying out. They've got it packaged all nice and neat, so that is adorable. And it says winter 2008 on it, so I guess that's what some of these are from. And here we go. Okay, so I think I ordered, yeah, I ordered five different samples. So these are so cute in there. Look at that. That's so cute. Oh, I can't wait. You can try these. Okay. So the first one that I got is their honey cinnamon rolls and these are the 5.2 milliliters or the samples and uh, then of course they go up from size from there but and I think these samples by themselves were $25. I don't know what that I mean you can smell the honey on it but oops. okay let me put some on I'm gonna be running out of space. Ooh. It's not like a, it's not like a typical honey smell. You can smell like honey in it, but I smell like some chives maybe? Oh, that smells so good. It smells more like a natural, and I got, I got this everywhere, but, <laughs> okay, for me, for a bit of my pants, but, um, oh, that smells so good. Let's see, yeah, it's the honey, honey cinnamon roll now it doesn't smell like a fresh kind of cinnamon roll out of the oven that you would think it would like i said it smells more a little bit more masculine than that because you can smell you can definitely smell the honey you can definitely smell the cinnamon in it but yeah it just i don't know it smells a bit more I, I, oh how do i explain that it just smells a bit more masculine like it really smells like cloves you know that kind of more like a Thanksgiving kind of smell, not more like a breakfasty kind of cinnamon roll smell. So let's go to the next one. Oh, this is the cotton candy one. I was super excited for that one too. I think it, I think the other scents are kind of overpowering this one. Not make a mess. Okay, so let's put that on. Oh, that does. That smells just like cotton candy. Kind of like a cotton candy Jolly Rancher. That's what that smells like. It smells like a cotton candy Jolly Rancher. Oh god, that smells so good. I kind of want to drink it. <laughs> There's a drink that we make that kind of smells like this. I, I want to drink that. Oh my god, these smells so good. Whew, okay, let's move on. And this is their Bonfire Pumpkin is the next one that I'm going to be... It's Bonfire Pumpkin is the next one. So... This one... I don't know what that smells like. Let's see here. Let's put a little dab on my arm. Okay, and because when you put them on out of the bottle, the scent changes, which I do like. The scent changes and ooh, okay, that smells. You that smells really like a gourd, you know, like that earthy kind of gourd smell. But it also smells sweet. With a little bit of smokiness, not much, but you can you can catch it on the tail end. Oh, that smells good. It's different. It's so different. It's not like if you're familiar with some of like the Bath and Body Works products and stuff. It doesn't have that kind of smell to it. It smells. I don't know. It just it smells different. It smells really good though. Uh, let's see here. Here's my next one. This is the candy corn cake pops. So this I got with Eddie of mine because he loves candy corn and who doesn't love cake pops? So let's try this one out. Okay, that does smell really, really sweet because I don't like candy corn. So I was skeptical on this one to start off with. Okay, so I'm going to put a little... Little dab and let me tell you a little goes a long way even with these little testers so I'm pretty sure if I got the big ones it would last me a good while so let's rub, rub a dub dub that in okay that's definitely smells like vanilla cake with a little bit of that candy corn smell so I do like that a lot better because I'm not like I said I'm not a big fan of candy corn but also I'm not against candy corn I just don't particularly eat it but I don't mind the way it smells but that, that smells really good. That does. You can really smell like a vanilla cake with it. And then you get like a little bit of hint of that candy corn. Oh, that smells good. Okay. So definitely, definitely, definitely going to be using more of these. Oop. And let's see. The next one I got is November. So I had to get this one just because 
I was born in November, so I was like, you know what? Let's just, let's just do this. I need something to round this out. So, because there were so many that I wanted to pick from, but I wanted some like kind of neutral flavors too, I guess, or not flavors, neutral scents. So let's do November and rub that in. Okay, now that definitely is a really kind of earthy kind of, that's a really fresh like pine smell. Oh, that smells good. Like it's, like I smell it and it kind of relaxes me a little bit. Yeah, that's like a really fresh like pine in wood smell. Like if you've ever been to the woods, it just says the start of autumn and everything's starting to turn orange and yellow and it's really pretty and you can get that like that first whiff of winter coming in. That's what that smells like. Oh my god, how did they put that in a bottle? And no, I'm not over, I promise you, I'm not over exaggerating this. This, because I live in the woods, so I, get, I know that smell. Oh, that smells so good. Oh, I probably, I, I'm, I have a feeling I'm going to be spending a lot more money on that site. <laughs> good. And the last thing that I got is, it is another body butter. It's the big body butter. So this is what the big ones look like. This is what their jars come in. And this is called Full Moon. So I had to, I had to partake because I am, if, if you've seen one of my other videos about my weekend stuff, then you know that um, I'm, I really love the Full Moon. But, um, so this is, again, this is another one of their body butters. Oh, uh, let's see here. And this is a lot creamier than some of the other body butters that I have. Oh, what is that smell? I don't know what to... It kind of smells like cheesecake <laughs> a little bit. It does. It kind of smells like cheesecake a little bit. I don't know why I would, though. Uh, let's see here. This has shea butter, uh, meadow foam, got a rice bean. Yeah, I'm not getting any of those. It's got aloe in it. I can't remember what it said the notes of this were supposed to be. Because on their website, they actually like put the notes of what everything is supposed to have in it. And I remember reading this one, and it just sounded like it was going to be really soothing and fresh. So, let's put this on a patch of skin that I haven't put stuff all over. Okay, see, when I rub that in... Oh, that smells really sweet, but I don't know if that's just because I have everything else on me. So, yeah, that smells really, really sweet. But it smells fresh, too. It's like a fresh sweet. Oh, that smells good. I'm glad I got the big one. Yeah, that smells amazing. It kind of smells a little bit like... even know I don't know what this thing is it's nothing like it smells like butter it does it sm you can smell butter in it and it smells sweet but it's not overpoweringly strong um it's not like one of those sickening like artificial sweet smells that make everybody sick it's not one of those oh it smells so good Okay, I can't wait to take a shower and <laughs> use this because that's the perfect time to use body butter is when you get out of the shower. Oh, this smells really good. Mm. Like I said, it has like a fresh smell to it, but with a little bit of sweetness. So it does, it smells really, really nice. Or that might just be me smelling everything else that's on my hand. I don't know. <laughs> I can't tell at this point. <laughs> but it does, I can, it's, it smells really, really nice. So, okay, so I'm happy. I'm, I'm a happy person. Oh, yay! Plus, I love it because it's kind of local for me. So, but like I said, everything that I did get is cruelty free. Um, it's all natural and everything, so it's good for you too. And I like the jars that it comes in. It's really cute. It's very simple, but it's really effective. So, that is everything that I got from Coca Pink or Coca Pink. So we'll just recap. Here is all twenty-five. Maybe 25. 
$25 worth, there we go, $25 worth of my samples of stuff. So I think this is probably going to last me a good bit too because I don't use these that often. So whenever I do, and like I said, you don't need much when you use these little things. But I did get the candy corn cake pop. I did get the honey cinnamon rolls. I got the November, which, oh, that, that is an amazing smell. Oh, I think I, I, I was more surprised by that one than any of the other ones. But um, I got Bonfire Pumpkin, and I got Cotton Candy Dreams. So those were the scents, again, that I got, along with the awesome little sample they sent me of the caramel popcorn balls, which smelled to die for. Oh my god, I want a big one of these now. And then, of course, I got the Full Moon, the, the scent I cannot place, but it smells oh. It, it smells really good. So, that is everything that I got. They have so many scents on their site, and you can get it either in, you can get it either in the body butters, or you can get it in their body oils, and they have a few other little things on their site, but I didn't delve too deep into them because I was mainly going after the body butters and the oils. So, you definitely have to check them out. Like I said, this is not sponsored anything. I just wanted to try their stuff because I was in the market for some new perfumes and things, and I'm trying to get a little bit more natural with my stuff instead of what I've normally been using. So, trying to try to be good for the whole world here, or you know, at least our little little section of it. But anyway, before I ramble on any more and just sit here and keep smelling stuff because, oh, the scents are everywhere. The scents are everywhere. It's great. But anyways, just remember to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. And leave me a comment down below if you've ever tried them out and what your thoughts about them. And if you do go and try them out, let me know what you got. And if you post a video about it, again, let me know because I'd like to see your reactions to that. And I will see you on the next video. Thank you so much, lovies. I hope you all have a fabulous rest of your week. Bye.